<laughs> AK standing on business. You know the streets is over with when AK is telling you got to check in and is getting changed back or whatnot. What happened to the watch though? You didn't get that watch back, did you? This got to be like the most gangster sh AK has ever done or taken part in, right? He talk about he didn't you in the J Prince. Yo, his head is getting real big right now. Bro. This nigga AK funny as hell. Pill boy, do boy, AK <laughs> academics. <laughs> nah, shout out to academics, man. But this shit funny as hell. He really stutting like he gangster like that. Like he got juice like that. A lot of these dudes only fuck with you because they know they need your platform to try to get on. And they, you know how it go? You could be anybody. If you got money, you know, you're going to have some gangsters that's going to try to get you. And you're going to have some gangsters that's going to just put you under their wing and protect you, right? That's just how it goes everywhere. Money go a long way. Especially when, you, when you're connected to the industry and they feel like you can help them get a feature or whatnot. For all I know is, I haven't heard the whole story on how this whole shit happened because I'm hearing a whole lot of different shit and I don't want to put the wrong shit out there. But for all you know, they set this shit up. A lot of these cities, they set you up. They'll rob you and then they'll sell you back your shit. Or they'll rob you and then they'll come back and give you shit just for the clout. Just to make you feel like you got to check in with them. And they built like that. They moving like that. They run the city, right? You know how many we used to rob and then just hit him back up and be like, yo, for real, they did they, they, what to you? I'm going I'm to touch in. I'm going to find out who did it. And then come back and be like, here. And it was my little man who got you. And I tried to stop him. But before I even reached out to him, he was already coming back with the shit. And I'm like, damn, man, you got him for his chain. You got him for his what? You got this. You got that. What can you give me back? All right. Let me get that back. Or oh, not, right? That's just what happens in the hood all the time. Like, a lot of times, shit do go down. Motherfuckers do get you. A lot of these internet games, this shit be all the plot. A lot of motherfuckers. I remember when we used to stay in Brooklyn, man. The plug would have stick-up kids that will rob you after you leave, like, two, three blocks. They, can only, they, they will make sure they'll protect you or so-called protect you a few blocks from, from the area where you're going to go see them, right? from the building or whatnot certain amount of blocks right after you hit like the fifth block they're running down on you like give it up let me get that how the fuck they know you just bought a half a brick you just bought a brick and you got jewelry or whatnot man they just took that brick back from you and it'll give you another one on credit after you call them up saying you got robbed and now you in a hole for a whole brick with the plug but they got your money and they got, come on, man. Like, I don't even want to keep talking, man. Academics, the new internet J Prince. Check in with Academics, Yo, man. He man. getting your jewelry back. <laughs> I'm the internet J Prince, man. I had to tap in my GGs real quick. They took my boy chain, I got it back. Ooh. Yo, Cap, I got you, nigga. Next time you go to Toronto, so tap it with the GGs, man. We straight. Shout out to the Wassers, you heard me? Come on, man. If y'all ain't know, my, my boy got his chain took in Toronto, but they f me so heavy, they said, act. Take it back. Real talk. 